millions of people who have lost their hearing in one ear and can't use hearing aids, this may hold new hope. Doctors at a Boston hospital are now fitting people with a new device that transmits sound through the patient's skull. How has this device worked out for you thus far? Maxine Kessler suddenly lost her hearing in her right ear four years ago because of an inner ear disorder. I was at home watching television and all of a sudden I couldn't hear out of my right ear. But Maxine wasn't a candidate for a conventional hearing aid and didn't want to undergo a surgery to fix her hearing. So this fall, she became one of the first patients to get fitted with a new device called the Soundbite at Boston Medical Center. Maxine's bad ear was fitted with an earpiece that has a tiny microphone. It transmits the sound to a special device that's placed on her jaw and carries the sound vibrations through her skull bones to her good ear. The sound will go via bone, so it goes into the tooth, up into the uh, skull bone where the ear is located, and then the sound vibrates the inner ear hair cells on the side where the hearing is good. It's a tremendous difference but in social situations, in work situations, I have to give talks. And I'm always w wondering, you know, am I talking loud enough? Am I talking too loud? Because I really couldn't sense what the sound was like. And so now I can, I think it's a great device. Patients tell me it's amazing that they can go out to a restaurant, sit between two people, and now they can actually hear what's being said on, on both sides of them. Now, depending on your insurance, some companies may pay for the new soundbite because it's considered a prosthetic device, not a hearing aid. For more information about this device, you can go to our website, cbsboston.com, and click on health. So we may not have gotten buckets of...